What's up everyone and welcome back to the channel Shift Happens. In this video, I'll be ordering the level 2 EV charger for my Jaguar from Amazon. Uh, hopefully, it should not take that much time to arrive. And right now, I can see that the price is somewhere around $249, but I am lucky to get a $100 coupon available on that purchase. So that takes down my price from $249 to $149 before taxes. And this price is in Canadian dollars on Amazon.ca. Uh, hopefully this parcel arrives before the delivery date that Amazon is showing currently, that is 3rd December. And I'm hopefully able to get my parcel even earlier than the expected date. So let's just wait for the parcel to arrive and we'll see what do we get in the box. So I just came outside the house and I noticed that our parcel has just arrived finally. So it's been like five or six days and I'm very excited to unbox this. Uh, so let's get inside the house, take this box in and unbox it real quick. Okay, so let's start the unboxing by taking this bag out of the box first and let's keep that on the table and keep the box aside. Uh, now let's see what's there in the bag. Let's unzip it and on top we have the manuals and the screws for the cable holder and the adapter holders. The second thing that we have is uh, an adapter to convert the NEMA plug to a 3 pin plug. Let's keep that on the table as well. Now we will be taking out the main charger and uh, that's a pretty heavy one actually so it took some time okay so let's uh, verify what's what let's take this thermocol out and unveil the four NEMA plugs and this is the CCS plug that goes inside the car uh, it's not focusing properly but we all have an idea what it looks like uh, this does come with a five-year warranty uh, as you can see on the sticker this is the main adapter unit that controls the charging and all the wireless function and that is the adapter holder itself uh, this is a very long 25 feet cable now let's keep this charger aside and let's see what do we have else in the back um, this thing is the cable adapter sorry this thing is the cable holder and this is the tesla adapter in the back that's the last item that we get with this whole package as we can see it's a 250 volt with maximum ampere ratings of 80 and that's a tera back okay so we just completed the unboxing of our tera charger this charger comes uh, pre-installed with CCS plug and comes with a Tesla adapter so that's the good thing uh, you can use the same charger for both the vehicles which has the CCS plug and the Tesla's NSCS adapter uh, NSCS uh, outlet I guess okay so now uh, we will be plugging this charger into our newly installed NEMA 1450 plug and let's see what's the charging speed difference with the old charger compared to the new one so let's begin long way unplug the charger wait for a few seconds Plug it back in. <sighs> the charging port initializes the wire and the connection and hopefully it should be ready anytime soon. It should show up green. Might take a few seconds. Okay. So if I get the camera, I can show you quickly. So currently it's showing that it will take somewhere around 46 hours and 59 minutes to completely charge the battery when it's sitting at 171 kilometers of range with 48% of charge. So as you saw, uh, this clearly takes a long time to charge the car's battery completely. But now with this new NEMA 1450 charger, we should be getting a good speed. Now let's unplug this charger again and then compare what this charger speed uh, comes up to. Stop. Okay, so now we'll unwrap the charger and let's see what charging speeds we get. This might take some time, but yeah, I'll do it as quick as possible. Okay, 
So one side is off. Yes. Remove the second one. It should not be touched, right? Okay, so there you go. We have removed the side plastics and now the plastic for the main charging unit. One important thing to note, uh, we ordered this from Amazon. Right now it's retailing at somewhere around $361 uh, as you can see in the picture. Uh, that's the current price actually. If, if it's not 361 then it's the current one. And uh, we got this at $250 that was listed at that time. But we had a $100 coupon that was uh, made available via Amazon itself. Like we didn't purchase any coupon or extra thing. But yeah, we got a $100 coupon applied to this uh, uh, product and we got it for $149 just, just $149. Okay, so while editing, I just checked the Amazon page for the same charger and I found uh, two links for the same charger like name, description, everything is exact. It's just that uh, one is black in color and one is white. Now there is a hundred dollar coupon still available and if if anybody wants they can get it on the same price that I got that uh, it's just that one of the links doesn't have that and the other link has that hundred dollar coupon I'll be linking them both in the description so and, and, and I'll be specifying like which has that coupon and which does not it's just that because if somebody wants to do a check by themselves uh, verifying both the links looking at all the descriptions provided maybe they might find something different or they might think that first one first link is different than the other they are free to do so so I'll be providing both of them and uh, make a wise decision that's all I would like to say they both are exactly the same I'm not sure why Terra is doing that thing where it's providing a hundred dollar coupon on one of the charger maybe they are trying to sell out the stock on the black one or uh, something like that I'm not sure why but I'll, I'll be linking them both so make your choice wisely let's let's continue with the main thing okay now we have our charging unit unwrapped uh, it's just this small wrapping that's still left. Let's remove this one as well. The main reason for making this video was uh, I didn't find any Terra Charger videos on YouTube apart from just one. And I thought that I need to cover this since this was a cheap option. And what if this cheap option might turn out bad, might turn out good, we are not sure. So this can be a trial for that. It, it can be a fresh one. Okay, so now I'm done with this plastic. Let's plug this charger into the NEMA plug. And let's see. Okay, so now I'm going to plug this inside this NEMA 1450 plug. And as we can see, the charging unit has turned on. I'm not sure if the camera is still able to pick that up. If, if you can come uh, get a closer look at this one. Okay, so these are all the charging status that we are able to see. I'm still not sure what it's actually, uh, I'm still not sure what it's actually showing up. I need to look at the manual and uh, understand completely. I believe this one comes at this one comes uh, equipped with the Wi-Fi and Bluetooth settings so you can schedule the charging times and you can turn on and off uh, this ch charging adapter uh, remotely you don't need to come and uh, unplug this thing every time so we will discover that uh, now let's try to connect the charging end into the car okay. but so now to see the charging status we'll need to unlock the car first and now I'll be plugging this into the car and then we'll quickly see on the instrument cluster how much speed we are getting. So, if you can come and get a closer look at the instrumental cluster, uh, we'll be able to see that thing right away. So, after counting to three, I'll be just plugging inside. Okay, one, two, and this goes right in. 
now the speed perfect so the speed currently is showing up is 7 hours and 12 minutes to charge the car completely when it's sitting at 49 percentage and 173 km range so first of all we'll go to the play store and we'll search smart life app we'll be selecting this one and as you can see i've already installed that so i'll just open it and there is the ev charger that we are <clears throat> talking about now uh, you may add this by clicking the blue plus icon on top right corner and then you can follow the process uh, as as is shown in the manual and uh, let's click on the ev charger and here we can see that to activate the charger we just swipe this green button to right as it says <coughs> swipe right to charge then this is a uh, real time charging mode button where you can see right now it's set to real time charging but you can also set it to delayed charging here you can set the length of time 1 hour 2 hour after how many hours this uh, charging should start then uh, it it it's showing current voltage over here in the voltage section at the very bottom we have three buttons uh, we are on the home screen right now of the charger then we have this record page and then there's the setting page so basically that's a complete overview of the test ev or the terra ev charger uh, in the smart life app and so as we saw there's a seven times speed difference with the level 2 charging the original charger was charging with somewhere around 16 amps or 10 amps at max and that was very slow for these types of vehicles uh, level 3 charging the one that we saw in joule that had a 100 kilowatt output whereas this with the 32 amperes is producing somewhere around 7 kilowatts of output so there's a much huge difference within joule and this charging but there's a huge difference with this charging and the original tar charger that it comes with so this is very evident from the video that this car will now charge at 7 hours time stamp compared to the 46 or 49 hours of time stamp so that was pretty much it with this video i kept this video purposefully short because we got this brand new charger for our ev and i just needed to show what this brand charger is how does it look how fast does it work and is it reliable or no i'll still be posting a video after some months to see if this uh, product holds up to its reputation or no and that was it for the video one thing to note that i did say in my last video that i'll be coming up with a new car but since we got this new charger and this is the only car that we have available at this point i had to show this car and the charging of it So next video I'll be coming up with a new one for sure and thanks for watching more than happy to welcome all the criticism and the comments uh, do share this video if you liked it and do like the video if you liked it so see you in the next one with a new car for sure